Hello everyone, welcome to Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we will learn how to find smallest and largest elements in singly linked list. So the problem statement says we have given a linked list of n nodes. We have to find the smallest and largest elements in the linked list. Let's see some examples. In the first example, we have given a linked list 17, 22, 13, 14, 15, null. Here maximum element is 22 and minimum element is 13. In the second example, we have given a linked list 43, 13, 54, 68, 23, 25, 20, null. Here maximum element is 68 and minimum element is 13. Let's see the algorithm to find the maximum element. We initialize max with int min. Max is the variable which will store maximum element present in the linked list. Traverse the given linked list and if max value is less than head value, then head value is assigned to max, otherwise head point to next node. We repeat step 3 until head is not equal to null. Let's see the C implementation of finding maximum element. The return type of this function is end since it will return maximum element which is of integer type. The function takes one argument the head of the linked list. Inside this function variable max is declared and is initialized with int underscore min. Now we start traversing the linked list and if current value of max is less than the current head data we update the max and current head value is assigned to max. After that, we update the head pointer to point to next node. Once we have traversed the whole linked list, means head pointer becomes null, we return max, which is the maximum element in the given linked list. Let's now see the algorithm to find the minimum element. We initialize min with int max. Min is the variable which will store minimum element present in the linked list. We traverse a given linked list and if min value is greater than head node, then head value is assigned to min, otherwise head point to next node. We repeat step 3 until head is not equal to null. Let's see the C implementation of finding minimum element. The return type of this function is int since it will return minimum element which is of integer type. The function takes one argument, the head node of the linked list. Inside this function, we have declared a min variable which is initialized with int underscore max. Now we start traversing the linked list and if current value of min is greater than current head data, then we update the min and current head data is assigned to min. After that, we update the head pointer to point to next node. Once we have traversed the whole linked list means head pointer becomes null, we return min which is the minimum element in the linked list. Time complexity of finding smallest and largest element in the linked list will be on since we are linearly traversing the linked list. With this we end our tutorial. Thank you for watching. Please leave us your likes and comments.